Hey everybody, it's Kelly from Kansas City Mamas, and today's better in 60 second tip is how to organize your stockpile. Today, we're in my stockpile. This is the area that I have in my basement that has all of our canned goods and dry staples. It's pretty impressive, right? You notice the um, no wall of toilet paper and no wall of diapers. Why? Because it's a stockpile I use. I use this stockpile to feed my family. But one of the biggest complaints that I get is, how do you organize it? How do you know what you have? How do you know what the dates are? I wanna show you a very simple tool to help you with that. It's called a Sharpie. They are invaluable for helping to organize your stockpile. Why? Well, two things. One is that when you bring new items into your stockpile, what I do is I go ahead and mark all of the old ones with an X. I do that so that when I send my husband or my children down to get items, they're not very good at looking at dates, but they are very good at looking for an X. And so I will say, go down and get me a can of black beans, and they will find one with an X and bring it upstairs. The other thing that's great about a Sharpie is if you're wondering um, how long or how long you should keep something or if you need to buy more of it, is go ahead and put the date on it. Especially with like detergents and deodorants and toothpaste, just write the date that you bought it on it and then kind of just keep marking and looking through it. If you find that it's been a year and you still have toothpaste, you probably don't need to buy any more toothpaste for a really long time because you probably have a good amount enough in your stockpile. So that's my better in 60 second tip in order how to organize your stockpile with the Sharpie.